the people who voted against the referendum, especially the mother one, we're not members of the far right, right. we're not confused, we're right. not misinformed, right. and if every single cabinet minister had walked up to my front door and asked me to vote for it, I wasn't going to vote for it because I was not deleting mothers from the constitution. And so many mothers contacted me and wrote to me about that aspect, which I addressed in one of my columns. It has been almost completely excluded from the analysis. And Maria Steen, who took on the Thonishna and beat him in that debate, wasn't interviewed by any mainstream media on Saturday. So I had to watch an interview with her on the gripped platform. Now, okay, what does that did, say? In fairness, Sarah Carey. Well, I fairness, did ask. We we did, and I'm sure every other media organisation voted or spoke to well, many I want to, people from the no side. But the, right uh, throughout the this aspect campaign. of mothers and is very important, and I want to say very this. Very important to you. We, we don't no, no, no. know how many people it was important. Okay, well, I we want to read out. This yet. was a text I got from a cousin of mine who sent it to me on Saturday, and she said, my whole circle of friends, work colleagues, Facebook friends, who are all mothers and all ends of the social structure in society, were most annoyed at the mother component. And I think that has been excluded excluded far too okay. much from the debate. Do you see this and as a swing back then? Do no, you think, I don't. Or a fight back to, some, to a more conservative Ireland? No. Because the sense was that we'd no. become more No, more not at all. And I was at a business networking meeting this morning for women and, and professional women were mm -hmm. saying to me there, of course I voted no. One woman said to me, if it wasn't in the constitution, I'd be fighting to put it in. Mothers are exhausted. They are exhausted mm -hmm. working. They're exhausted looking after their children. They're exhausted keeping up to a standard that they can't meet. And the National Women's Council of Ireland does not represent them. Great. And the okay. government listens to, to hear Mary briefly.